What's going on guys and welcome back to another episode of Ark the Center. Now before we get started you might be wondering why we're on the carnivore island. In front of me is this raft and inside this raft is a max level male pyromane and we're going to see if we can try to tame this thing. So I've set it up in the trap. I made a raft off camera basically trapping this thing in here. And uh, hopefully it won't be able to, once I start driving this thing, I'm literally right under it. Alright, so we should be fine. We've got the stone all ready to go. We've got some floating walls for whatever reason. I hope that's not going to affect it in any way. So, it's not in the best spot as you can see. It's like far north. We need it to be like far south and whatever. So, let's see if we can go into K mode. As long as we kind of hug the coast, we shouldn't be bothered by any lead fees, but... Yeah, whatever. We'll just, uh, keep going until we end up in, like, a place I want to be in. So, yeah, I went through the trouble of building this base here, this trap for the pyromane, because I watched the Axeman's video on how to tame this thing, and basically what you gotta do is you set up a trap on a raft, lure the pyromane to the raft, and then bring it to a more safe enclosure and whatever. And it got out. Yep. Alright. Yep. I knew these walls. I knew it would be too easy. You know what? What we might do instead, we might just do the traditional whatever. Alright. Um, uh, give me one second while I let out the... The, what's it called? Oh, now you spawn in. Alright, so let me just dock the raft somewhere. And then lure the pyromane back in. So we're using the mono for this exact purpose. Yeah, so as you can see, I leveled this guy up a bunch in, like, all health. I want to make sure this guy is an absolute tank. Alright, so the pyromane's probably in the water. Or would it be better to use the D-Arc? Simply because we can shoot off the back of the D-Arc and we can swim, so. Alright, hopefully that guy doesn't drown. But if he does, it's not the end of the world. Because I've seen a couple of other high levels, like a, a 145 female, a 140 male. So yeah, even if this 150 dies, it's not the end of the world. And as long as he's doused, he shouldn't throw fireballs at us. So we should be golden. Come on. Get in. Alright, it's in. It's in. Oh, I didn't want to get off. I want to close the gate. Close the gate. There we go. It's in. It's in. Alright, we got it in. Awesome. Alright, so now for the tricky part. Getting this guy to a safer environment. Because this place is loaded with T-Rexes, Raptors, and whatever. And now getting him to the island is going to be tricky as well because, you know, of Leeds Ichthys. But as long as we kind of hug the coast, we should be golden. Alright, the guy's kind of chill, so we should be good. Alright, every now and then, let me just watch this, and I'll see, go into K mode. Yeah, as you can see, we're not in the best spot. If we could just make it to the southern part of that island, we can then travel to one of the nearby islands, and then tame it there. That's kind of the goal. And of course it's raining, so this would have been perfect to tame this guy, because the rain kind of douses this guy as well. So. Yeah, that would have been perfect. So we'll just keep going and see what we can do here. So let's keep going. Oh, Jesus. Yep, that's a lead Zikthys. Ouch. A lead Zikthys just destroyed the raft. Yep, that's what I figured would happen. Oh, my God. And it was an alpha lead Zikthys as well. Alright, let's just get back on land. That that was a failure. That was a failure. 
Yeah, see, that's the problem with taming these guys. Uh, Alright, let's see if we could do it the traditional way while, you know, it's still raining. It's not the end of the world. We've still got a 145 somewhere, a 130, 135. This guy's still alive. Alright. Let's see if we could do this the old-fashioned way, I guess. Alright, this guy won't aggro to the bottom. So, we're gonna have to attack him. Alright, come on. we have a lot of health, we should be good. We've got a bunch of health, so we just need to damage him enough where he can be ridden. Alright, no, don't, don't, don't bug out. Don't bug out. I know you want to go on land. Alright, you're kind of just stuck in the water. Maybe I can ride you from here, maybe? Alright, I think it's, I think it's good. Now we have 30 seconds to do this. All right, uh, whistle, follow all. All right, Mono, follow me back to base. All right, let's go. All right, that's good. We're at 21% tamed. Okay. This is good. This is good. All right. Oh, we are on low health. Uh, we're 75% of the way there. Okay, game. Game. Thank you. Uh, we need to find something else to kill. We've got 18 seconds to find something else. Oh, we got a raptor. Perfect. Alright. Perfect. Carno. Perfect. Left control. And we did it. We tamed a pyromane. Honestly, that was actually pretty easy. If I do say so myself. Oh, okay, the T-Rex is kind of attacking another pyromane, it looks like. Alright, where's the mono? That's a level 50 pyromane. Alright, we got the pyromane. I think I do see the mono somewhere. Honestly, a lot easier than I thought it would be. Probably because of my taming settings, but... This was relatively easy. So now there is this 145 female that we could go ahead and tame. So let's, uh... You know what? Take a screenshot for the thumbnail. There we go. This is perfect weather for that. And then if you press left control C... It turns into a shoulder pet. Oh, how cool is that? That is so cool. Alright, let's go find the mono. Alright, let's see if we could find the 145 mono, or pyromane. Honestly, that was a lot easier than I thought it would be. Like, I didn't know it was going to be that easy. Maybe it's because of the tame settings, I'm not sure, but... Yeah, it was pretty easy, so... We'll see if we can get the female, and then we'll breed them up... Get an imprinted version, and we should be good to go. So I'll see you guys in a little bit. Let me see if I can find that 145 female. Is that it? That's it. That's the 145. Okay. First things first, we need to get it away from that cliff. Get out of here before that T-Rex catches whiff of us. All right, there's the 145 pyromane. Ouch. All right, get put out. There we go. So now we need to do enough damage where we can ride it. Alright, the T-Rex isn't after us. Alright, he's warring. Let's attack things. Maybe this T-Rex. Okay, that's a 135. That probably wasn't a good idea. Alright, I just didn't... Okay, that's probably... T-Rex, probably not the best idea. 135 T-Rex. Okay, get out the way, rocks. I thought I saw a Carno somewhere. Okay, there's the other Pyromanes. Don't get hit by the T-Rex. Too much. Oh, 
Our pyro main. No, not pyro main. Uh, mono keep tanking that Rax. Uh, how close is he? Yeah. Okay, um. Let's get out of here. I hope we do heal from this. We're almost dead. Oh, we're 65% tame. This T Rex might help out. Absorb. Absorb. 90% tamed. Alright, come on. Ouch. Okay. We're doing good. We're doing good. And there we have it. Female has been tamed. Alright, we've tamed the female, so let's finish off this T-Rex. 135. Alright, let's go ahead. And, uh... We got the female. Let's go. We'll put you away. Alright, so we got a male and a female pyromane. Now, let's get out of here before... Let's get out of here before another pyromane decides it wants to attack us. Let's go ahead and kill this Pyromane. 303 damage. Or Carno, sorry. Alright, so let's... we. Alright, so it broke my pants. So that's that's fine, I guess. Let's take out the D-Arc. Put you away. Alright. We successfully managed to tame two Pyromanes. We got a 145 female and a max level male. So, yeah. I, I'd say that was actually a lot easier than I thought it would be. You know, probably because of the taming settings, I'm not sure. But regardless, that was actually pretty easy. So what we're going to do is we're going to go home, breed them up, get an imprinted version, and we'll see what that's all about. So I will see you guys in a little bit. And we're finally back at base. Home sweet home. Let's land over here. And let's check our bad boys out. So let's go ahead and... Uh, so here's the male. So let's look at the stats real quick. So the male had 38 points into health, 42 points into melee, and the female had 35 points into health, 37 points into melee. Okay, so the male's definitely better when it comes to stats. So let's put the pyromane somewhere over here. There we go. You kind of reset to your large state. You came out at a 219, so you might have lost some taming effectiveness, but it's fine. And then we got the 145 female. So we got a high-level male and a high-level female in the same episode. Okay, that's, I gotta say, relatively easy. So we're gonna go ahead and put these guys on breed. Let's breed these two up, and we'll get a baby from it. And then we'll see what the imprinted one is like. And then we could use that as our main guy, I guess. And just like that, our new bred up Pyromane has been fully imprinted. So he's got about 7,200 health. That's pretty good to start with. 1,400 stamina, 700 weight, and 1,100 melee. That's pretty good. Let's start by killing this turtle real quick. Let's put everyone on passive. 600 damage to start with. That's really good, actually. Holy crap. Oh, yeah, you were the max level. Oh, where's that baby moss chops? There you are. You know, I'm gonna tame you. Just because you're a max level. Uh, can I breed? Can I tame you? Please, let me tame you. Let me, let me claim you. Thank you. Alright. So you're the max level. I'm gonna put everyone else on neutral. So I could test this guy out. Oh, that's a beautiful Sintel. Only level 55, though. 918 damage. I'm guessing that's with the, with the headshot. That was a max level Dillo I just killed. Oh, yeah. This, this guy is really good. Yeah. I would say, you know what? This guy is worth it. The female looks good, but I kind of prefer the male just because of the mane. 
But yeah, we'll see if we can get an imprinted male, and, and we'll have to see what happens here. And maybe we could get some mutations from these guys as well. So let's level up a bit. We've got 51 points. Let's go up into... Let's get your weight up to 1,000. Let's get your health up to 100,000. And then put the rest into melee. Maybe get your stamina up to 2,000 and then just put the rest into melee. Alright, let's see what you're all about now. 3,000 damage. That's really good. That is really good. Alright. So we went ahead and tamed ourselves a pyromane and or two pyromanes and we got an imprinted version. Which is really cool, if I do say so myself. And I love how you can switch them over to shoulder pets. So I guess left control and C, it becomes a shoulder pet. Look at that. I did not mean to press that. Did not mean to press that. I wanted to press this. Alright, let's switch that back to the big form. Alright. And with that, I think that's going to have to wrap it up for this episode. If you enjoyed it, make sure to leave a like and subscribe for more. It would really help out a ton. But until next time, I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.